Hello guys, Nateness1234 here with the paintball server. I know you guys have been waiting for it for a very long time. It's been a while. It took a lot of effort into making this map, it took a lot of builders, it took a lot of work, but it's finally done. And before we get into this, I have some things that I need to talk about to you guys, uh, letting you guys know what's going on with the channel and things like that. So firstly, if you guys didn't already know, I do have a Twitch now. And the reason I have a Twitch now is because you guys are actually behind on a lot of episodes on factions. And you guys miss a lot of material when I, um, when I record. Because I just record like all the important events. Like I remember we just, we were, we were live streaming a, um, we were live streaming on the server and we ended up, um, there was a battle that I didn't get on video because I usually only record like big events like raids and wars and different things like that and big builds so yeah so um what happened was we were actually in a war and we ended up blowing we ended up making a minefield and we killed the entire faction so it was pretty funny except it didn't get on YouTube it was just on uh, my live stream so, but, anyways, my Twitch is nateness1234 now, so you guys can go ahead and check out my Twitch. You guys can go watch all the, like, behind-the-scenes type stuff on the faction server, so whenever we're not recording, all that, like, us just goofing around on the server, having fun, you know, telling jokes, just talking about random stuff, because that's what we do on the server when we're not recording. We're just... We're just goofing around, working on our base, and having little battles, and we still, we never know what's going to happen, so we might as well watch it. So, anyways, b besides that, there's also, uh, you guys need to go ahead and follow my Twitter now, because I, I have a Twitter, if you guys didn't know. Um, it's nateness1234, just like everything else. You guys can go ahead and follow that, get all the updates on the server, like new things coming out on the server, and stuff like that. So, I cannot do this damn thing here can I <laughs> but anyways so so guys so um what's going to be happening with there's a lot of new things that are going to be happening with the server and there's a lot of new stuff on the channel so I'm going to talk about a little bit of that um I'm actually going to what we're going to be doing now on my channel is we're going to be doing giveaways so there's going to be a giveaway there's um I'm I'm not completely in charge of the giveaway, but uh, Wolfpack Media, another YouTube channel, we're partnering up to do giveaways now on my channel and his. All you guys need to do for the giveaway is follow or subscribe to my channel, and then subscribe to uh, subscribe to his channel, Wolfpack Media. The link will be in the description of all my videos where I talk about the giveaways. And then all you have to do is comment Redstone down in the comments. And I know right now for Christmas he's doing uh, PS4 games. I don't know exactly what games. I know they're really popular games. He hasn't told me what games, but there's three games, so there will be three winners for the thing, and it's going to be uh, PS4 games. So that's going to be pretty cool. All you guys need to do is go ahead and comment Redstone down in all my videos. Not all of them, just any of the videos, and we're going to go ahead and select three winners. I think two maybe from my channel and one maybe from his. So that's it with that and then another thing is if you guys haven't seen the faction series which I'm pretty sure most of you guys have the um, factions series is actually going to be changing a little bit and I know you guys have been complaining a lot and saying you know well there's uh, why does it have to be this many subscribers to get the map the reason is not because I'm trying to be a dick about it it's because there is updates constantly happening on that server there is like constant stuff always happening we're doing like, I mean, stuff is changing all the time, and I know it's 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 a lot right now, and it's only been six episodes. You guys are actually kind of behind on episodes, but um, there's six episodes, and we've done a lot of updates. Like, I know now there's a, we're going to be adding a starter kit coming soon. So, I mean, that's the reason behind the, the subscriber... Uh, the subscriber checkpoint is so I can get all the updates in the server that I need to before I release it so it's pure because then after a while we're not going to be adding many more updates because it's just going to be spot on and when we do it won't be a big one so that's the reason behind you know there's a subscriber uh, or checkpoint before the map is released just so we can get all the updates packed into the server before it's released but anyways, this is the 300 subscriber special map. I'm glad to release it, and 
back to factions is factions is actually what we're going to be doing is something I want to talk about that I actually talk about a lot of this stuff in another factions episode that you guys haven't seen yet because like I said you guys are kind of behind on episodes but I talk about how we're going to be having a uh, we're going to be having a, another host on the server not necessarily like me but it's going to be like a big type of moderator and he's at be bigger than the rest of the moderators and the reason for that is he won't actually play on the server he's just gonna be like this big moderator and what he's gonna do is he's gonna go around the server and he's going to build these monuments like whether it be a castle uh, a sand tower towers whatever uh, a hut house whatever it may be He's going to uh, like cover this monument in bedrock, encase it in a bedrock box, and then he's going to put a bedrock covered chest inside of there. And at a certain point during w my episodes, he'll release the coordinates to that monument to everyone in the server. And everyone in the server will head there. He'll break the bedrock casing around the monument. We'll all battle out there and stuff, and then at a certain time, we'll have a timer going. At a certain time, he will actually break the uh, bedrock block uh, on top of the chest so we can access, access the chest, which will be filled with random loot that all factions are really going to want to get because it's going to be really good loot. And what that's going to do is basically just have a full-out wars on the server. It's going to create a lot of drama, a lot of fun stuff, so there's going to be some big wars on the server because of that. So that's a new thing I'd like to add to the server. And also, we have actually had a few raids so far. I know you guys probably haven't... Yeah, you guys have not seen, I don't think, any of them. There's been a, big raids on the server. I know we got raided. Uh, we raided another faction. So And there were some wars, some big wars. So I'm hoping to release those episodes soon so you guys can get into that. It's uh, The drama on the server is getting a lot more crazy. I know the first few episodes have been kind of plain, but now I think um, after that they kind of get into it. Another thing I need to talk about, as you guys can see, in my top of my screen I have a face cam now. So um, what's, what's up with that is my face cam is going to be on all my live streams and all my videos so you guys will be able to see my face, my reactions, things like that. As well as that um, titles, that title rotating around in the top of the screen. What that is, is right now it's not doing it because I haven't said it, but factions episodes from now on, all types of episodes from now on, what it's going to do is, because you guys don't know about it yet, I talk about this in another episode, but what that's what that is is from now on you guys any recent subscribers between my previous video and my next video will be mentioned up in the top your name thanks for subscribing things like that will be mentioned up in the top of the video for that episode so you guys will get your name in my episode it'll just keep rotating around so I thought that was kind of cool so you guys have a little you know kind of a treat for helping me out because I'll help you out that kind of thing so anyways I think that's everything I needed to talk about I don't think there's much else except for yeah I think that's it but I actually I will not but but now let's get into this map because I know I've been talking for a fuckload of time so I have worked very 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 hard on this map I have um, done a lot of work with some spawn stuff over here we just have the you know the uh, thanks for playing the 300 subscriber special stuff the uh, subscribe thanks for subscribing and thanks for all the support type of thing so right now I want to show you guys the map look at this I was thinking when I was first gonna make the map I was like alright you know what I'm gonna make a cool little paintball map and then I decided I'm gonna make a fucking computer fuck it so I just went full all out right with the map I just went crazy because I had so much time to work on it and that's why it's taken so long because I know I hit 300 subscribers quite a while ago but it's taken so long because it's so crazy so um what actually this map is so nice it's so efficient so complex it works like a charm there's only two buttons basically that function the entire map so it's very simple there's not even any rules because it's so simple to use all you need to do is push reset server 
These are the two main buttons, reset server and start game. Those are the two main buttons on the actual server, so that's it. It is it just pounds everything out for you. It works like a fucking beast. So, <laughs> let's go ahead and get into the map. I'll show you guys the map. All right, so when you guys start, you'll come up here. You have the, these are just exit doorways to the actual map, so you can come back to the spawn. And this is just as exit. This right here is just the exit for the spectator mode. And up here, this is where you're going to go to go ahead and play the map. We have a little lookout there, kind of see the server a little bit. And then over here, we have another window. We just see all the redstone, the goodies, and the bullshit that, <laughs> that the map functions on. So when you come in here, you have three places to go. You have the spectator mode, which is this is the spectator mode. Um, what this does is uh, this button right here activates the spectator mode. So I'll go ahead and read this real quick. It says only activate when a spectator will be present and will give spectator ability to end the game. So basically what this does is when a spectator is going to be present, you just push this so that way, because right now if you just have like a 2v2 or a 1v1 type thing, it's just the players will actually end the game. So if there's going to be a spectator, might as well have them so we can have basically the privilege to control the game so that's what that is it just gives the spectator the ability to control the game so that the players do not have to end it all right so here we have our team our little team uh, hangouts in here we have the uh, this just makes it so that uh, people cannot actually enter anything while the game has already started so that's what that is you guys are probably running wondering what that redstone is both things are somebody's calling me <laughs> both things are identical so both team uh, team hangouts are the exact same both team uh, <laughs> both um, team I I all right but both of the um, team things right here are the exact same as you guys can see they're the they're just identical just look opposite to each other and over here I'll just show you guys the host one over here so the host will go in red it really doesn't matter if it's not the host or, or not you just push one button so in here we have our paintball guns you go in here and these little shower things and it'll give you your paintball gun and your bullets and you walk over here and as you can see it's modded gives you a little zoom as you guys know all my maps are modded make all of them mod as much as I can make them fun make them cool I don't like simple I like complicated so yeah it has a little zoom on it just for you guys' entertainment over here you get your builder barrier build, barrier builder kit and what this does is you just go ahead and push this button it's gonna fill up this chest with 32 leaves so that you can build with when the game starts so that you can avoid arrows and stuff and then let's just wait for this and in here we have the paintball gear so you walk in here it'll give you all your paintball gear walk out and you got we'll walk back over here and grab our leaves so as you can see we have our leaves this is our full set of gear all right so we have the paintball gun and we have the paintball gear which is just normal boots you put those on your head it'll probably take this off so then we have the camouflage these right here are camouflage potions for only five seconds each so you drink these and basically you only get one shot off of it at another player and you guys are probably like what the hell why'd you put spawn egg in there well the spawn egg is the decoy what the decoy is is just a villager obviously and what he does is he just kind of as you can see when when you like move the villager moves with you so like he'll turn his body and it's kind of like more of a shield than a decoy or you can use it as a decoy it really doesn't matter but I like to use him as shields so just go ahead and shoot from there shoot from there and be like it's just like kind of a little barrier so I thought that was pretty cool. Just added it, just to add it, and that's really it. And as you guys can see, the camouflage works. Just five second invisibility. So, anyways, when you guys are ready, both teams are ready to play. You just come in here and you hit start game. What this is gonna do is release both of the doors at the same time, and then it's gonna start this clock right here for grace period. 
So once the bell goes off from the clock, that means grace period's over, so you can start shooting players. It just gives you a time to build, so you're not walking out just straight up shooting people. All right, guys, sorry about that. So once this is over and you start building your barriers and everything, just so I can give you guys like a little representation of what actually happens when the server resets, um, all this basically goes away. So you, know, I mean, uh, it's just really, really efficient. Let me just go ahead and place down some uh, leaves everywhere, make these little barriers and whatnot, and put stuff everywhere and all the good stuff. All right. So once the game is over and one team has actually won or killed the other team and one team is the last alive, you go ahead and the winning team just goes ahead and hits this button right here. It's going to give you like a little celebration on both sides and it's going to let you out of the arena. And then you walk through here, you walk out here, you just go through that little thing and you come back to spawn. And what it's going to do is you just walk up here, hit the reset button. What that is up there, that bar up there, that just gives you the time remaining for the reset. So once the server, the server's going to go ahead and start resetting. I think you guys can hear it a little bit, just resetting. Doing all of its work in there. Resetting all the pods and everything like that, all the good stuff. So yeah, now we walk back through here. Server's ready to play again. Back to normal. Perfect. Ready to go. As you can see, there's a little leaf burning. And we have one left. But yeah, you saw I put down like a ton of leaves. So two leaves is nice. So yeah, that just basically just makes it really easy. It just makes it perfect so that way you don't have to destroy everything and go back in here and like creative and destroy all the barriers and everything. And it makes it so you don't have to like go ahead and do all the uh, um do all that work or in survival or whatever you would do so yeah i just thought that would make it really nifty just so it, instead of having to come in here and break all these leaves you just come in and create it and go ahead and do it so, or you just push excuse me you just push a button and you go ahead and do it because you won't need to come in and create it but yeah so that's basically what happens i'll go ahead and actually show you guys what actually happens oops i'll go ahead and show you guys what actually happens when you, the server is resetting, besides all of the other machines getting reset. And I completely fucked that up. So, as you guys can see, this is what happens when the server resets. Just goes nuts, burns as much as it can with fire, and then it has these pistons which go ahead and clear all of the remaining leaves on the floor, and all the fire too. Just sets it all out, and the server is back ready for use. So that's what that does. And yeah, I mean, guys, I worked really hard on this map just to make it perfect, just to make it all clean as hell, make it so it's really simple to use. It doesn't even need instructions because it's so simple. And I mean, it just it's just so com well, not compact, because look at this motherfucker. It looks like a goddamn computer. But yeah, anyway, guys, it's really nice. Um, I like the way it functions. I love playing on it. I think it's really fun. Um, it works really well, and I hope you guys enjoy it as much as I have, even though I kind of suck at it. <laughs> but I hope you guys enjoy it just as much as I do. And now, for go ahead and s follow my Twitch, my uh, Twitter. Go ahead and subscribe so we can get up to the next map, which will be released soon. And go ahead and make sure you write down Redstone in the comments below so you guys can go ahead and get that uh, giveaway. It will be three PS4 games and we will select three random people. Just go ahead and comment Redstone down in the comments to, get, uh, to win those giveaways. And then I think that that is it. I think that that's all I needed to talk about. That's the whole map, whole gist of the map. And now what I'm going to do guys is I'm going to show you guys me and a few other people just having some fun me and a few other youtubers just having some fun on the map playing a little bit and we'll go ahead and speed this up so let's go ahead and get into it